Well, it seems my friend of the past is the topic of today. Now, what I mean by a friend of the past, you see, before I started doing these kind of videos, I did some gameplay videos, you know, me playing some horror games. And one of them happened to be my good old friend Slenderman. So that is what we're going to be discussing today. Slenderman. Now, you're probably wondering, what does Slenderman have to do with anything? Well, I'm going to get to that question. I will get to that right now. You see, we have a girl. And I believe this was in Florida, so... Florida, what is going on? So, we got this girl who ends up setting her house on fire after an argument. A 14-year-old girl sets their house on fire. She, you know, she gets like a towel, right? She, like she grabs something, she uh, dips it in bleach with, with some room, and then she sets it on fire. Just the whole house going fire. You know, yeah, fire. Motherfucking fire. Now, why did she do that? Well, apparently it was because the Slender Man motivated her. What? Well, she was reading, uh, like, when she took off, she took some food and she went and slept inside of, like, she went into the woods and something like that. Uh, she slept in the bathroom or some kind. Like, she went to the park and she slept in the bathroom. Some, somewhere like that. But, uh, pretty crazy, though, how she was ended up reading uh, an ebook, Soul Eater. And she was, like, she had a diary or something, you know, like, talking about killing. Like, you know, like, if it, the Slender Man convinced, like, the Slender Man convinced her to do that. But this isn't, this is the first time Slender Man was involved in something. I remember a while ago, there was these two, well, the two 12-year-old girls, I believe, two 12-year-old girls, you can search it up for yourself on this one, uh, two 12-year-old girls stabbed their friend 19 times as an offering to the Slender Man, hoping that he would appear and take the two of them to his big ass mansion because you know he has a tuxedo and everything you know he's, he's gotta be a rich he's gotta be bloated you know he's gotta have all this money so they stabbed your friend and the two of them were hoping that Slender Man would come and um take him away take him far far away damn we really got to let the kids these days know what's going on I mean what the hell man 12 year old stabbing their friend as an offering, as a sacrifice to the Slender Man. The man with no face, the man with the tux. You know, the freaking tall ass dude, tall. If you haven't, um, if you have no idea what Slender Man is, if you've never seen him before, then um, feel free to click on, you know, go check out my channel. It's one of the first videos I made right before, you know, the little incident thing happened. So it is one of the first videos one of the first ones i made before you know before i did this so you want to go check that out feel free to go check it out but damn i remember back in the days where kids believed in santa claus the easter bunny all of these kind of things but never would they believe in such a thing as slender man you know like she was um this the 14 year old girl Set her house on fire. Apparently, you know, she was doing research. You know, she kept looking up all these things online about the Slender Man, these stories, all this kind of things. But, uh, that's insane. That's absolutely insane. And, um, if Slender Man basically, I mean, I've seen a documentary, a documentary about um, him being real. Something about him in Germany. I'm like, what? That doesn't sound right. Slenderman in Germany. Now, Slenderman in Florida, that sounds about right because apparently a lot of shit's been going on in Florida. I mean, damn. I mean, I mean, lots of shit happens everywhere, but all these big ones, all these things, all these big, big things going on are in Florida. What's going on there, guys? What's go Seriously, what's going on? I mean, sh I had plans of, you know, like, visiting once in my life, you know? Like, damn, I want to at least check out Florida hit the beaches or something, 
But what, what, what are these things are going on? Slenderman offerings and stuff? Oh, uh, fuck off. When things calm down, I'll probably go. Same thing for airplanes. I don't even have a thought in my mind about taking an airplane. But until shit calms down, no, 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 no. Too much things going on with airplanes these days. Way too many things. Just way too many things. Well, with that, until the next time, I will see you later. Goodbye, you guys. I said it.